everybody, this is Praxis. Today is day 50 since I kind of started this process and there has been a lot of non-movement uh, over the past couple weeks. I mean, I've been sharing with you guys that really just had a difficult time getting contractors to show up. Uh, we've been waiting for the weather to work out for us and we've had a couple of bumps where the weather warmed up enough to pour concrete and we always had these promises from the contractor that they'd actually be there and they just they keep not showing up now my site work person has been great they've been on top of everything but they are telling me they're having trouble getting uh, you know a commitment from the concrete people uh, the people that had come out to the site we did a walkthrough together they came out for the free part of the work but now where it's time where you know they could actually do something to get paid for some reason, they're completely MIA, and this has been going on for a long time. So, uh, I I I just sent uh, a message out to the uh, the site work person and just said, you know, this person is just they've been blowing you off over and over again. Uh, you know, I'm not a big fan of doing the same thing over and over again, expecting different results each time. You know, if they've blown us off, you know, three or four times already, you know, why do we think that this is not going to just continue. So while we're going to continue to try to engage with this person, because allegedly they do very good work, um, we're working on backup plans and trying to get in touch with some other people that could potentially do this, because I don't want to go like month after month of just, you know, not hearing from these people and me just sitting doing kind of nothing. Uh, at the same time, we are going to start working on clearing out the site. Uh, you know, if we don't get something moving this week in terms of a foundation, we're going to clear out an area on site so I can at least get lumber delivered. You know, that way, even if the concrete isn't being poured, even this, if this just continues to be a ridiculous thing going on month after month, I can be preparing the lumber. I can be cutting it to size. Now, obviously, well, maybe not obviously. It's obvious to me because I've done it before. You don't necessarily want to go cutting everything because when you get a foundation poured and it's supposed to be a certain size, it's only supposed to be that certain size. You know, the rubber meets the road when things actually get poured into reality. And sometimes things can be, you know, a half an inch, maybe an inch off, things like that. So I'm not going to go and start uh, cutting like sill plates and things that are going to engage directly down with the foundation itself. But there is a lot of lumber that I can uh, start preparing. I can start organizing things. There's a lot of things I can do uh, if I can get my lumber delivered. So I think I'm going to work on that and uh, and go w w from there. Uh, but at the same time, we're going to just keep hammering the contractor, asking them to show up. You know, we've engaged them. They said they're committed to the project you know, actually showing up. I, you know, again, the work ethic of people. I, I don't, people are always patting themselves on the back about like, you know, oh, I'm such a hard worker, this, that, you know, I'm trustworthy. I do what I say I'm going to do. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I, it just seems more and more, I, you know, maybe it's just the sign of our times. You know, I, I was talking to someone from Comcast the other day talking about, you know, pre-staging the idea of getting some high-speed internet at this place because remarkably it seems like there's high-speed internet available in this area even though it is very rural and the person on the other end of the phone hung up on me in the middle of the call I, I mean and you guys know me I'm not like an asshole or anything uh, just I don't know there's just a tension in the air and I don't know it's already already feels like things are falling apart to some degree but uh yeah anyway we're going to keep pushing this thing forward just because things things aren't easy doesn't mean you just put up your hands and quit. And we're not putting up our hands. We're not going to quit. But we got to come up with another way of moving forward because, you know, this thing we've been trying for for about two months now, you know, these concrete people, they don't seem like they're going to be showing up necessarily unless maybe tomorrow they show up. At surprise. That's it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time, hopefully with good news. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video. And if you'd like to support this channel, you can do so both through Patreon or PayPal.